Hello guys, this is Jacko from Muddy Tiger Outdoors and today um, it's beautiful outside. I didn't get to go out to the woods but I have something really cool to show you and as the title uh, uh, says this is the One Tigris Tactical Molly Compatible uh, Dump Pouch or Recovery Pouch. Um, I got this item because uh, One Tigris is uh, one of those brands that it's starting to become uh, very popular. This is something that I've seen on Facebook, I've seen it on Amazon, I've seen it on, on several other YouTube channels and it's something that definitely caught my eye because it's right up my alley. There's a lot of tactical gear, there's a lot of uh, uh, bushcraft type gear, a lot of backpacks, a lot of really cool uh, durable um, uh, items that you know I, I kind of wanted to give a try. So uh, this dump pouch, um, I got it a few weeks ago and I've had a chance to take it to the range once. Uh, and I had planned to, um, you know, do some video with me using my rifle and putting my uh, spent uh, magazines in the pouch. But unfortunately, the range where I go, they don't allow you to, uh, to record any type of video or take any type of photography. So I wasn't able to do that. Uh, but I'll be able to show you what this pouch is all about. So my very first impression of the pouch is the quality. Uh, and it's kind of one of the first things that I did when I took it out of the uh, uh, package when I first received it in the mail. I started looking at it, I, I took a look at the stitching, took a look at the uh, webbing, uh, the, the molly straps, the webbing at the back. It's all very, very well made. Um, you know, the inside, I turned it inside out. Uh, there's a bungee cord here with a, um, a tightening uh, device. Uh, I mean, it's, it's, it's very, very well made. So. You know, the only two companies that make similar uh, uh, stuff to this that I am familiar with would be one Condor and the other one would be Maxpedition. And I tell you what, this is right up there with those two guys. I mean, uh, uh, Maxpedition, it's a little bit on the pricier side. Condor is a little bit more affordable to me and this is even better because uh, the value that you get, uh, you know, with something that is quality similar to those two brands, a little bit cheaper than that. It uh, definitely always represents gr uh, great value. At the bottom, you can see it's it's a little bit squared off, and the thickness is it's very uh, easy to just stack your magazines in order. If you have an AR-15 type uh, rifle or an AK-47 type rifle, you can just kind of stack them side by side as you put them in the pouch, um, nice and neatly, and you know you can fit at least six mags, five mags in there easy. Um, the other thing about it is if you're just you know practicing. Uh, nice and fast reload so you can just put them in there and if you take a look in here at the mouth the mouth is round but you can kind of cinch it with a drawstring and you can make it um, to where the magazines are going to come in but they're not going to come out of the pouch so you know your hand still fits in there but if you're running if you're you know crouching if you're uh, 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 running for cover and you're doing this kind of stuff your your pouch is going up and down no nothing that you put in there is going to come out you can cinch it even tighter you can close it completely and there's nothing that is going to come out of that now it's elastic so you can still put your magazines in there and not worry about anything coming out so that's kind of a nice thing um, of course like any gear that I get um, I always try to make sure that it is multi-purpose and when I say multi-purpose can I use it for more than one thing can I this is this is meant to be a dump pouch pouch for a magazine um, but can I use it for other things and the answer is yes <clears throat> one thing that I haven't used it for and I'm planning on is you know for you when you have a shotgun you're going hunting um, and you want to keep your shells a little bit more easy access this would be perfect to hold your shells I don't know how many shells you can fit in here probably about 30 or, or 20 um, just put them in there and every time you have to reload just reach on the side pull them out and then uh, reload your shotgun um, the other um, uh, aspect about this is you know if you take a look at the back um, you know, it's molly compatible so if you have molly gear you can attach it to that or you can attach it to your belt to your waist but the nice thing about it is it also has a loop around the uh, front and that loop you, if you have a carabiner or if you just want to strap it to to some device similar to a carabiner or any kind of a hook it can go like that as well and it's just kind of uh, uh, free hanging so two two ways to attach it and it's um, you know makes it a lot more compatible to whatever kind of gear that you have 
Now, if you're kind of like me and also likes to do some projects around the house, you know, put a few things up and drill and all that kind of stuff, and you don't have a belt uh, for your tools, you don't have one of those fancy pans, you can actually use this to put your tools. Uh, as you can see, I can fit a number of tools, pliers, screwdriver, uh, you know, just a, a bunch of different things, even a saw. If you're working out in the yard, you're trimming some of the bushes, trimming some of the trees, you can definitely put your stuff in there um, and, you know, not worry about it. I don't feel like it's pulling a hole in my belt because of that webbing um, molly uh, attachment. It, it feels very, very nice. It feels very secure in there, easy access. So no problem there. You know, I imagine it would be the same if you want to put, instead of tools, you want to put um, hardware like screws, nails, uh, anchors, all that kind of stuff. Very easy access. You're there. If you don't want your stuff to fall out, again, you can just cinch it and it's nice and tight. Nothing falls out. So pretty cool little pouch. So extremely easy to attach it to your belt. Just undo the buttons, feed through your belt. Pull the straps down and then reattach with the snaps. And there you go. Very easy access. Now another use that I'm very excited, um, you know, to try with this pouch is for my cook kit. Um, you know, I have a, a little mesh back for my cook kit, and sometimes, you know, I feel like I'm gonna, you know, hit it and dent it, or, or if I take it out of the pouch, there's not a whole lot of things that I can fit in there. But with this, um, if you have a similar cook set to this, this is the Optimus Crocs. You can just kind of fit it in there very, very easily, um, and then it all goes in there nice and neat. And then, you know, when you're done putting your stuff in there, all you have to do is just pull the inner layer out like this and then just cinch it, close it up, and there you go. Everything is nice, nothing's gonna fall out, and you can still fit a, a couple more things in there, like a fair serum rod, a lighter, anything that you like to keep in there, along with your cook set. Um, the nice thing about having your cook set like this is if you decide to take it out uh, of the pouch, uh, and use this for you know gathering food sources, going out and uh, foraging, uh, gathering fire making materials like uh, twigs, branches, kindling, uh, you know fluffy things. You can still do that. So again, if you're out in the woods like me, um, and you like to to have something that you can use for a couple of different things at the same time, then it's it's a great uh, it's a great idea. So. Now coming back to the construction of the uh, pouch, uh, again the stitching is, is very well done. The moly straps feel pretty strong. It has the moly um, webbing right here on one of the sides, which is nice to put. You know, things like your knife, if you, if you want to carry a little folding knife, there you go. You can just carry it right there. A light, you can attach a light to that. A pan, uh, whatever you feel like you need to carry as far as um, uh, uh, small items. And then on the other side, you have a little mesh pouch, which is pretty nice. Um, if you have, if, let's say you're you're practicing uh, uh, reloading drills with your rifle, and you also want to keep a, a little area for your magazine pistol to go, well, very easy. You can just kind of dump your, your magazine in there, your, your spent magazine, and it's a perfect size for a full-size um, uh, pistol magazine. So, you know, uh, a great thing to have that little uh, pouch available on the side. Now, the inside of the pouch, it's made out of this. It's just kind of shell slash cordura type uh, uh, material. Now, if you take a close look at this, it has a little extra pouch inside of the pouch, which is great. I mean, you can uh, securely stuff anything in there that you want, or you want to have that extra insurance that whatever you put in here is not going to fall out of the pouch. Well, you can just kind of velcro it shut, and there it is. That's that's kind of a neat uh, feature to have. All the grommets seem to be very well placed and very nicely stitched. Uh, obviously, it's it's reinforced, and the whole thing it's kind of double layer with that uh, inside of the material. And of course, you've got up the front a uh, little place for a morale patch, velcro patch, and you know they come with these little one tigress patch, which obviously is going to stay there. It matches. It's black and it uh, it's where it belongs. So that's a pretty cool uh, uh, thing. And lastly, if you don't think that was enough uh, features for a, for you know this kind of an item, at the very front there's another Velcro pouch. 
So again, another pouch, and it's big enough to almost fit my hand in there. So if you want to put your cell phone in there, very easily do so. And it fits perfect, uh, uh, the size of a iPhone 5 or one of those Galaxy cell phones. It's in there, it's not gonna go everywhere, anywhere because it's secured with a Velcro, so. Or if you also like to practice uh, reloading drills at home for self-defense or for home defense, definitely able to do so. You don't have to worry about, uh, you know, pausing and putting your magazines safely somewhere else or, or potentially dropping on the floor. You can actually use this dome pouch and do the exact same thing. So if you guys have any questions, just let me know. I'm going to go ahead and post a link to their Facebook page, the One Tigress. Um, again, uh, they're very active on Facebook. I went ahead and liked their page on Facebook just because I know they post a lot of really cool pictures uh, of tactical gear. So if you're kind of like me that likes to just watch, you know, look at pictures, uh, watch videos and stuff like that, they post a lot of that stuff in their uh, Facebook page. So Now, as with most of my gear, you will definitely see me using this pouch uh, in my future videos. I'm trying to find a range where they'll let me film or let me take some video as I am doing some drills and practice drills but uh, definitely I'm going to be using this every time I go out to the woods it's going to be my new pouch for my cook set and of course you know I'm going to use it to uh, whenever it's time to gather materials for fire making or, or even food sources so I'll definitely be using this pouch well guys I hope you like the video don't forget to like don't forget to subscribe please check us out on Facebook Muddy Tiger Outdoors we'll see you guys in the next video take care